Hey guys, and welcome back to Red Dead Redemption Undead Nightmare. When we last left off, we went hunting and indeed exterminated the entire race of Sasquatches, which, yeah, okay, okay, maybe, maybe that's a little bit of a hit in the morals, but, you know, I mean, we were asked to do a job and we did the job. That's all that matters at the end of the day. We also hogtied a, a woman and left her there to chill. She appears to have got up and bugged off. I suppose someone else uh, let her free, which, you know, was the whole point in bringing her here in the first place. You know, it was saving her. We weren't really just going to leave her out in the woods with a load of dead Sasquatches and undead boars and zombies. I mean, that wouldn't have been very gentlemanly of us now, would it? Oh, no, 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 no. So I believe many may disagree that we did the right thing. Now, we need to go all the way back out here and find our horse. We really need some weapons or some ammo. We've got plenty of weapons. Well, can you ever have plenty of weapons? I think there's always room for improvement when it comes to weapons. But we Oh, shit. Alright, don't worry about it, John. Oh, okay, I don't know what happened there. We tried to jump on a rock and failed miserably, but that's okay. That's okay. Just keep running, just keep running, just keep running. Oh yeah, we can look behind us somehow. There we go. That's actually going to be an incredibly important feature. <sighs> now, where's Sparkles? Hey, Sparkles. Sparkles, buddy, you're back there, really. I didn't think you could spawn back there. Never mind. It matters not from whence you came. It's more important where we're going. Almost lost Sparkles for good. I get the feeling if we lose our horse, uh, we are going to probably... Ooh, fuck my arse and call me Charlie. Yeah. Okay. Okay, if we lose our horse, we're probably hosed. Not definitely hosed, just probably hosed. Yeah, I'm sure we can get another one. I'm not 100% sure on the logistics of getting another one. But I'm sure it's possible. Let's actually quip our lasso just in case we come across any uh, mythical beasts. And we really need to be a little bit more careful uh, running around like a loony bin. There we go. <sighs> Back out of that place. I hate that place. Oh, it's a nightmare. I don't hate it. It's actually pretty cool. But it's a nightmare to navigate. Very treacherous. Back out in the open plains. Um, okay. We have Zeds up ahead. Oh, look at this. Where we? Oh, we have some serious distance to go. Dinner for two. All right. Let's go get some dinner, guys. Let's ride. Come on, Sparkles. You haven't eaten for at least as long as I have. Sorry right for these damn zombies. If the worst comes to the worst for the zombies, they can damn well eat each other. But us, we prefer something uh, a little bit more palatable. Like a chicken or a boar. Well, you know what? When all else fails, a nice old loaf of crusty bread sprinkled with cheese... Delicately cut, filled with garlic and butter. Oh, man, I need to make garlic bread again. Topped off with some chives. In fact, you can go a little bit uh, a little bit fancy with it if you want and uh, add some nice blue cheese. Mmm. Yes. Very nice. You know what I'm going to do later, guys? I'm going to make garlic bread. I haven't done that for ages. Nice tiger loaf. Mmm. Sounds very, very good. Might even make some stuffed uh, mushrooms to go with it. Mmm, stuffed mushrooms is something that I haven't made before. Nice bit of uh, well-fried break, break, bacon? Yeah, bacon. Zombie bacon. It will now be called... No, that'd be... No, that, no, that doesn't sound right. Bacon. We're going to forget that. Okay, this is dodgy ground now. Too busy thinking about garlic bread and bacon. Ugh, Tanner's reach. Cool. Don't fall into the water. I'm sorry, Sparkles. I am giving you a bit of a hard time at the moment, but that's because I'm thinking about bacon. 
Now, I don't agree with frying food, okay? I don't even have uh, any kind of fryer in my house, actually. But bacon, fried bacon, oh, it's, it's where it is, you know? You fry it until it's absolutely crispy. Until you can practically build houses with the stuff. And I also think chips should be fried. Or fries, as our American friends call them. Nothing else, in my opinion, should be fried. Uh oh. You know what? We can just take a shortcut here. Oh, that works. Oh, this is nice and safe. Better not charge across here too fast now. Yeah. There we go. That worked lovely. Ooh. Alright. Alright, I will come to your aid, sir. Uh, not with the lasso, I won't. Now, what are you going to give me for saving you, buddy? Hopefully something nice. Hey, hang on. Didn't we get a load of uh, ammo for this last time around? Uh, buddy, you right there? Oh, no, he's dead. Oh, we lost our friend. I mean, he probably wasn't our friend anyway. I'm definitely starting to think saving people in this game. It's just going to be insane. I actually think the zombies are slightly OP. But that's okay. I'm sure... Oh, God. Yeah, that coupled with the fact that they just indefinitely spawn. Fuck off. Oh, we need to kill some of these guys. You... And you, I think that will work. I think we got them. I think we did. We don't want the bodies to disappear because we need to loot them for ammo. Hello, my dear. Nice to finally make your acquaintance. I'm sure you were a lovely woman before you died. I'm sure most of you were. But that's no longer our problem, is it? Oh god, that was a terrible shot. Sparkles, what are you doing? You're just like running around. With no shits to give. Ooh. Ooh. Something bad is happening over here. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Something bad is going to be happening to us in a minute. Right, search. Search corpses. Okay, we can be hit whilst we're doing that. That's not great. Ooh, god. Just keep running, John. Just keep running. Don't worry about it. Come here, you little bastard. And you. And you, sir. Plenty of choppy for everyone. <sighs> Ooh, found another tomahawk. Nice. Well, that didn't go well. Mm, I don't know, John. I think that went pretty well, considering. How do we measure our success, you may be asking. Well, I measure my success by the fact that we're not dead. Come on, buddy. Ouch, ouch. You've got no head. Why do you have no head? Oh, what the hell is going on over here? Damn. These guys don't need any help. These guys are cleaning house all by themselves. All right. I will help you anyway, considering it costs me nothing. Um, these guys don't have heads, guys. In fact, these guys... Okay. The game is glitching out. Hmm. I thought that was strange. I'm like, pretty sure humans have heads and hands and skin in general places. Similar places to me, actually. But, uh, I guess not. Not quite sure what the frick is going on there. Yeah. Oh, hello. Hello. Oh, you're eager. You're extremely eager. Can you stop shooting her, please, while she's so close to me? 
I thought that was some weird kind of zombie that had no weapon. <coughs> I guess not. Yeah, we're going to rob them. Can we stop getting... Oh, God. You are quite the speedy chap. Yeah, we're pretty much out of bullets, my friend. That's why we're here, looting all your bodies. Rifle ammo. These guys don't give a lot, though, do they? What have we got now? Not much. Let's just load everything up. Well, at least this well-organized fire group actually did some damage. I say well-organized. Maybe that's a bit of a stretch. I mean, they survived, so there's that. Right, where did our friendo have his last stand? It's over here, wasn't it? Ooh. Well... We didn't get a lot, but what we got was better than nothing. I guess you can't look a gift horse in the mouth. Let's go. Yeah, there's rocks there, horse. I'm just saying. I'm sure you know what you're doing. You probably have a much better idea of what you're doing than I. Ooh. Don't worry about it, mister. I'm here to help. Oh, how the hell are we going to hit them in the head? Uh, are we just going to have to, like, guess where the heads are? I think so. That's kind of okay, I guess? That's got to be some kind of record. Behold my power. Uh, yeah, I'm not enjoying the fact these guys don't have heads. I'm finding it confusing, to say the least. For a start, I thought we had to destroy the zombie's head to kill them. But these guys don't have heads to start with. Neither do you. You don't have arms, either. Now, what did you give me, pal? You didn't give me anything for my trouble. Oh, no, I think you gave me revolver ammo. That's okay. I like the revolver ammo. So we spent six, we got twelve. As long as we made a profit. Alright. Well, ammo supplies are looking slightly healthier. Come on. But still leaving a little to be desired. Aha. Uh -huh. You must save this town before starting or continuing a survivor mission located here. That makes sense. Oh, McFarlane Ranch. Alright. Oh, man. This is going to be a big one. Are you ready, horsey? You ready, Sparkles? This could be chaotic. This could be extremely chaotic. Luckily, we have no bullets. So that's a plus. Not a fan of the way that we have to tap A to run. Holy crap! There is some serious lead being slung here. Well, I'm not planning on letting you die. Although you have no head, so... I'm not sure how you could die. If you can survive not having a head or arms, for that matter. That's pretty impressive. You've got like a Rayman thing going on. Well, nope, this will work. This is actually where you start at the beginning of the game, I believe. Survivor leader, there we go. You're running low, yet you're letting off rounds left and right. Give five repeater ammo, go on. Uh, yeah, maybe. Maybe. So if we got go round and give all these guys ammo. Is that how this works? How do we get up there? Hello, Mr. Invisible Man. I'm just exploring your fine town. Trying to work out 
how to get up on top of buildings and whatnot. You know what? Getting on top of the buildings is, I think, more trouble than it's worth. Where the hell are all the zombies at? That's what I want to know. So this is where we need to be to start the mission. Hey, I wonder if we're going to be uh, working with what's her name? Uh, the main female character. I can't remember what she was called now. Something McFarlane. I really need to play the original game again. Like, really bad. How do we get up here? Up here, I think. And then, there we go. That's not too bad. Hello. What can I do for you? More repeater ammo. Seriously? I would rather be shooting these guys. So that's what those circles are above. It looks like that. Just means that we've saved these people, I think. Or helped them. Maybe. How the fuck do we even get up there? I mean, let's be honest. The climbing system in this game is broken. So somehow we've got to get up here. And then onto the roof. However, I don't know. See, some things you can climb up without any issue at all. And other times you can't. Like, surely we can... Um, are you shooting zombies? No. You're shooting dogs. But right, bear in mind, I've given these guys ten bullets. And they're literally just blasting um, through about a thousand. Not really sure. Can I get sparkles? Can sparkles be mounted and then jumped off. If I go ride horse, can we then like stand up on him and use him to jump off? Watch out. No. So how do we talk to people then that are up there? There has to be a way, surely. And we're on fire. God damn it. Please don't burn to death, John. Thank you. It's hard enough just climbing it onto boxes in front. Okay. Okay, I genuinely have no idea how the hell we get up onto buildings. Oh, sorry, love. Didn't see you there. Right, how do we get up to you? John, you're on fire, mate. Okay, that's not how we get up there. Okay. So, they want you to get on top of buildings, but they forgot to implement a, a climbing, a competent climbing system in the game. You've got one that kind of works now and again. Sometimes, if you get lucky. Right, there's your bullets. So there's. Yeah, I'm hoping someone finds a cure too, lady. I guess that kind of works. Maybe if we can knock these guys down. See, it looks like we could almost climb from there onto that. But I'm guessing we're going to burn if we jump onto this. Yeah. Uh. However, apparently there is some ammo in this room. I'm in a bad place. Let's put the tomahawk down. Now where there's the chest. I'm not a fan of giving away all of this ammo we're finding. However, when there's no actual zombies to fight, we I guess we've got no choice. Um there's another one over here. Well, the zombies over here. No, the zombies are not over here. 
Do we have to shoot the dogs? That doesn't make any sense. Why would we be shooting the dogs? They don't even look like zombie dogs. Is this a bug that zombies don't appear? It kind of feels like it should be. More valuable than gold now. Yeah. Now this wouldn't be a problem if we could actually get up there. Whoa. Uh, that was bad. You're using bullets that the survivors have requested. Be careful not to leave them high and dry. Yeah. Yo, what about me, guys? They only need another 10 anyway. That would be enough for the survivors. Right, so where are the survivors that want bullets? Okay, so there's one. Okay, that one there isn't actually... Um, isn't actually on a building, so that's useful. Unless we're supposed to go around here, give these guys ammo, and then the zombies attack? That would be a new mechanic, I guess. Oh no, apparently, apparently they are up. Okay, that's fine. <clears throat> Can we climb the ladder? John, the, 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 the big, the big John, the the ladder right in front of your face, John. No, John. The, yeah. There we. Yeah, that's it. There we go. Ooh. That was a boss fight and a half, wasn't it? Climbing the ladder. I have no words. I have no words. Right. Now, if we can just give this headless chap five bullets, so go. he'll be happy. Now, Keep it coming. I hope you do the same thing. Well, that's two of the five bullets I gave you. Okay, don't use that's three of the bullets I gave you. You've got two left. Remember, there are zombies coming, right? Oh, there's more ammo caches too. Let's go grab those. Um, please don't be a Please don't be above. No, it's not. It's there. Yeah, um, I'm not sure how we're supposed to get on buildings. At least some of them, anyway. Can we open the door? There we go. Seems a bit strange to lock all this ammo up around the place. About time. How much have Peter ammo have we got now? We've got lots. I say lots. Seems like more than it actually is. Right, we've got status under attack. Uh, it's really not under attack. Sorry to burst your bubble, but it's really not under attack. Can you see any zombies here, John? Because I can't. There's a couple of dogs wandering around. There sure as hell ain't no bloody uh, zombies. Need to get a big wall built up around this place. Pretty stat. Now, the question is, how the hell do we get up there? We can jump onto that, but how? How do we get on there? Every time we jump here, he just glitches out. There's nothing here to jump onto. We've got this wooden pile here, which looks kind of like we should be able to get up there, but... Oh, come on. Right, okay. Let's get up to the wall and jump. Yeah. Yeah, there's no way we're getting up there. And I'm guessing can we oh what the how how the hell you know what we're not going to ask questions we're just going to accept it we're just going to accept it 
Right. Kill the remaining un- Now there are undead. Wait. Which ones are undead? What? But- You better be clean. What? Are you- What the fuck is going on? Who's undead? I can't tell who's who because no one has a head. Um, these guys aren't undead. Yeah, now they're all going to shoot me. Um. Okay. Now I have got the latest patch for this game installed. Now there are zombies everywhere. Okay. Right, well now the game is working properly. We can uh, actually do something. Right, that's... Interesting. Rockstar's... Quality is usually a lot higher than this. Okay, this now makes more sense. This makes much more sense. Now, what are we doing? We've got an arse ton of zombies. I'm really curious about that bug. Right, can we just... Okay, we can just jump up here straight away. Right. You can have some bullets. There you go. Now, actually, I'm not going to give all my repeater ammo away. Okay. That's not what we wanted. Now, come on, John. Use the axe. Chop the neck. Okay, this is, I think, going to be preferable to giving all of our ammo away. Because this way we get to find all of the ammo, keep the ammo, and still save everybody. So, everybody wins. Apart from the people that don't. And it's much easier than jumping up and down buildings. Chop. 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 Hey, you're a double chop. You cheeky git. And this way we gain ammo, not lose it. And if I may be so bold, this is more fun than giving our ammo away. Although, I wonder if there's an achievement for um, giving ammo to everyone. Oh god, you're a bit vicious. Oh shit. Oh shit, we've rustled them up. We've rustled some jimmies, guys. Jimmies have been rustled. Luckily, we have a tomahawk. <sighs> okay. Yeah, that was kind of an interesting adventure we just had with the bugs and all. Ooh. You know, that whole animation and that sound with the uh, with the tomahawk is so satisfying. Let's keep grabbing ammo, because we need ammo. We need ammo more than these guys do. I mean, for God's sakes, these guys have unlimited ammo. Whereas we have to hunt Sasquatches and uh, dogs and zombies and all kinds of things. We literally have a handful of bullets at the best of times. More valuable than gold now. You're damn straight it's more valuable than gold, John. If we had a pocket full of gold, we'd probably give that away. But we're sure as hell not giving away our valuable ammo. Can you please not attack Sparkles? What has Sparkles done to you? Seriously. Oh, don't burn me. Don't burn me. Please don't burn me. Don't. Set me on fire. Nope. You should be burning to death. There we go. You've burned to death. You're dead. Anybody else want to challenge me? I am taking all comers. Hello, love. There we go. Just what you wanted. Whoa, you're on fire. My god. He's blazing a trail behind us, isn't he? There we go. Beautiful. That is poetry, my friends. That is poetry. 
more repeater ammo. This is a really good way of generating ammo, even if it is fairly slow. Ooh, hello. Hello. Lady, put some clothes on, honestly. I don't want to have to do that to you, but you left me no choice. Now, who has bullets here? You do. You do want to think about it. It's an important job, after all. Hello, lady. Splat. Hey, buddy. You have some bullets for me, don't you? Ooh, kill the remaining undead. There's not many left now. Ooh. I like it when they give us gifts. Don't you, John? Makes you feel like you're part of the community. You know? Part of the neighborhood watch. <laughs> Just let the bodies pile up. Stack them high. Let God sort them out. Although there obviously is no God. Because if there was, why would there be undead roaming the streets? Huh? Think about it. Okay. Now we have saved the day once more. This town has been saved. Excellent. So we can actually do the mission that's here now. But we are out of time. So let's go grab up all this repeater ammo. Ooh. I wouldn't want to eat those crops now. Probably full of zombie mold. Rotten flesh and all that kind of stuff. Uh, we're not going to go to that just yet because we'll probably trigger the mission. And we really don't want to trigger the mission. Okay. Let's go find somewhere to sleep for the night. Yeah, that was really strange. Um, there was no zombies here the first time. It was almost like it was running the normal variation of this town. With people everywhere, which is kind of curious. Well, let's put our head down for the night. This is not where we put our head down for the night. Yes, it is. Oh, we get to sleep in the jail. Um, that's a little bit awkward and hard to explain. But uh, if that's where it is, that's where it is. So, guys... Thank you. Um, I'm actually going to start alternating saves because of the quantity of bugs we're getting. So that seems like it might be a good idea. So thanks for watching, guys. When we come back, yeah, I guess we're going to go have a romantic dinner for two. Uh, till then.